now we go to the next question a 19 year old a 19 year old man fell off a skateboard reporting the blunt injury to his upper abdomen the abdominal ct and mr cp reveals pancreatic injury can you see main pancreatic duct at the middle of the body which of the following will be the most appropriate management now when we are talking about this concept before that you have to understand how do we define a pancreatic injury so when we talk about pancreatic injury we have a classification which is known as wong classification or wong grading system so we have five grades we have five grades one is the minor contusion or laceration minor contusion or laceration without without ductal disruption without ductal disruption the grade 2 yes is major contusion major contusion without disruption without disruption or laceration without ductal disruption of duct grade 3 is the distal distal transaction or distal injury with ductal disruption that's a distal pancreatic injury with duct distal ductal injury grade 4 is the proximal injury proximal injury involving the ampulla ampulla with ductal disruption with ductal disruption and if we talk about grade 5 that is massive pancreatic injury massive pancreatic injury so if we talk about grade 1 and grade 2 grade 1 and grade 2 they are the one where duct is not injured and hence they should be managed conservatively conservatively remember if we talk about the 3 4 and 5 so in 3 in case of 3 we need to go for distal pancreatic tummy and this is your choice if there is a splenic injury you can go for splenic tummy also so plus splenic tummy if you talk about this is plus and minus if you put type 5 type 4 this is central pancreatic las resection so central pancreatic tummy you will remove the part of central pancreatic tummy with anastomosis with anastomosis so anastomosis of duct to jejunum so this is just like what we do in the beagers basically you will remove that part and you will bring the loop of jejunum so ruen by reconstruction is done and here this is the one where you need to do we where we need to do pancreatic tummy so this is how the things are so if you go to this mcq non operative management absolutely wrong endoscopic stenting no absolutely wrong the most preferred answer here will be distal pancreatic tummy with splenic preservation or without so here since spleen is not involved we will go for splenic preservation primary repair of pancreatic duct with close suction radius no it can be done for the smaller injuries